All right, David Kahn here with another question from your Hayes & Harris Math SL textbook. This is exercise 2D.2, question 2. I want to know how much compound interest is earned by investing this initial amount, 20,000 euros, at 12% per annum. That means that it accrues at 12% every year at the end of the year. The investment's over a four-year period. All right, so since I start with 20,000 euros, I'm going to say that my initial element in this sequence is 20,000. Now what's the common factor? Well when you invest you expect to get your investment back plus interest. The interest is 12 percent and getting your investment back is represented by getting an additional 100 percent. So you get 100 percent of what you invest and the additional 12 percent. So we can expect that at the end of each year our investment will grow by 112 percent or will grow to 112% of its original value. Expressed as a raw number, that's 1.12, and that's our common ratio. Now, which term in the sequence are we looking for? Well, we want to invest over a four-year period. After one year, we've gone through one compound that takes us from our initial element to the second element in the term. So one year gives us the second element. Two years takes us to the third element. Three years takes us to the fourth element and four years takes us to the fifth element. So we're going to look for the fifth term, u5, in this sequence. In general, a geometric sequence follows the pattern un equals u1 r to the power of n take 1. We're looking for u5, so we're going to let n be equal to 5. The initial term is 20,000. The common ratio is 1.12 and n is 5. So 5 take 1. We'll uh, raise 1.12 to the power of 4 and multiply by 20,000. You can punch that all into your calculator. And when you do, you get 31,500 euros. So over four years, the whole investment has grown by over 50%. So basically what this means is that if you can find an investment that grows at 12% per annum, let me know and we're going to start investing together, okay? Thanks.